guys it's Keith from stock hours here today we're gonna be going over a trade that I took on meta um, I'll let that trade play out and then we'll go over it at the end 102 has a pretty big wall meta. I'm in these did you just make a new high it yeah, broke by 20 cents yeah like I said I'm in light with something like this because this pulls back I don't want to get hurt Put the green here. There we go. I'm gonna use 10150 as my stop loss. I'm gonna be very strict just because I don't need to hold that long. This should be pushes. Look at the market pulling back here. Mm -hmm. Bro, this should squeeze. Like squeeze, squeeze. This looks amazing. There we go. Oh my god. Shout out to Nor. That's 13%, guys. Wow. 15%. Yeah, 15%. You're welcome. You got one cent away from the gap. Holy shit, that was crazy. The market hasn't even reversed yet. The market reverses. That is out of here. I'm going to take some off here. That's what's pushing. Meta was doing his own thing while that big red candle there. That's what Meta is doing its own thing. I would pay attention here, guys. 102.50 is a level you should be paying attention to. 102 calls is what looks good. Yeah, this does look good. Trust me. There it goes. It looks good. There it goes. New high. Five cents. Here we go. Oh, look at this channel on ES and, and, and Meta's doing that. That's so crazy. Look at Tesla. Tesla's doing the same exact thing. Yeah, Meta's ready to C104 today. There oh, wow. it goes, Nuha. Shout out to the second signal on Meta because I told you 102.50 is the level to get in at. Oh my god. You would have made like another 10, 12%. Can I hear that or no? No, what happened? Okay, good. Scaling out a half. Moving. Oh my god. This is about to grab attention from everybody. Everybody. Yeah. This looks sick. Up, right? That's so squeezing. Blue cheese. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're gonna start watching Tesla here. Yeah, Tesla's getting really close. I'll be honest, I can't switch over to Tesla. I'm, I'm up 30% on Meta right now, about to get up. Deal, right? It's worth, it was worth it. Meta's going for a new high now. Yeah, Meta, bro, I'm telling you, the way Meta's moving, this has no reason not to see 104, but it does have this one minute trend, though, at 103.30. I just don't know if it, the, the Meta can get past that, um, but with this strength, it should be able to. We'll see. Alright, now I'm looking at Tesla, guys. Right now it's just following in, too, kind of. I want to see clear strength here coming up to the level. You're right. Uh, it is kind of showing a little bit of strength because there's a wick on ES and stuff. Yeah, it's trying to hold after NQ pumps it there. What level exactly are we looking at? 194.70? Yeah. I'm in these 200 calls. Oh my god. Wow. There we go. Wow. Perfect. I'll take it, bro. Yes, it's starting to push too. Yeah, yes, it's out of the rest there. Oh my god! Oh my god. Oh, so, oh, I'm out. Let's go. All right, guys. So you can see we got um pretty good entry on this trade here. Um, we entered on this red to green candle. My target was gonna be the 103 break. Um, so I bought half of my position here at this red to green, and then add. At the 102.50 break, if we had the correct momentum going through it, um, you can see we did reject pretty hard at that 102.50 level. Um, I was going to be using 
the break of this uptrend as a stop loss because I had already scaled out of half of my position. Um, and I could have gotten out for a pretty flat, pretty flat day if I was using this uptrend as a stop loss. But you can see we held this uptrend right here. Um, we ended up coming back up and pushing through this little flat top that this uptrend created. And you can just see the momentum this does look um, that happened through that. And then we ended up pushing all the way through 102.50. I added more on this push right here. And then I got out of half of that position right here just on this momentum push. And then I was saving the other half for the 103 break. Um, since I had waited for this long in this trade, though, I was looking to get out of the rest of my position at the top of this trend line. You can see, though, that that just didn't end up happening. Um, so I was sitting pretty comfortably in this trade. Um, and once I saw Meta stop pushing with NQ, um, right around here, I just decided to call it and exit the rest of my position on that trade. Um, regardless, that was a decent trade um, on Meta, $783 profit for the day so yeah thanks for watching hope you guys enjoyed this hope you learned something from this make sure to press like comment subscribe all that good stuff and we will see you next week peace